I was like, widget, widget, and I, I, I can't let him go. <laughs> yeah! What up, y'all? Welcome back to another one. Oh, come on, old Coop. Oh, he's ready. Oh, what a unit. We're in the old tracks. It's going down. Like I said in the last video, it's warming up. It's getting muddy. It's getting wet. Uh, we're heading to the field for another midday mallard shoot, y'all. Yeah. It's a muddy one. It's real muddy. Yeah. <laughs> it is definitely muddy. <laughs> <laughs> you like the mud. Look, he's ready for mud the mud. Means mud, mud means ducks. Mud means ducks. <laughs> oh, look at this. The snows are everywhere, boys and gals. Since it's thawing out, uh, the birds are loving it. They were pushing out, but a lot of water already opened up this morning. And uh, the birds, looks like they're coming back north a little bit. They're going to stall up here. Actually have water. They're going to have a lot of good hunt in the next two weeks. Yeah, boy. <laughs> Did I catch you off guard? Shoot some mallards in the sun and one. Should Dude, be good. This is gorgeous. It is. What a little hide. It is. Right along this, this regrowth here. and. We got ducks kind of trading back and forth between water over here and up there so kind of in the middle of them they've been feeding out in here so yeah should be a good one dude this is nick y'all met we all met you a year ago in august early honker season good to be back it is it is it's good to be back up north tons of birds tons and tons of birds uh this is what we got going on here we got a little mixed spread going on the boys set the whole spread before we even showed up Big shout out to Nick. Big shout out to Alex. They put in such good work out here at Flatland Flyways. Uh, but check it out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I had to recount them. There's so many. Again, second day, 11 mojos. Same spread, full body ducks. And they do have the dive bomb silhouettes out here today. Oh, yeah. But first off, I want to let you guys know two things. At Ducks Waterfowl, the thermal hoodies, all three colors are back in stock, and we're doing a huge sale for Halloween. Yes, I will link the Halloween sale down in the description below. Go pick something up and save yourself some money. Everything will be on sale. This is cool. Yeah, that's awesome. Yep, let's get in, baby. Let's get in. I'm so excited. Oh, we're gonna see some white birds. Hopefully we'll pluck a white bird or two, but there's ducks everywhere. Look at above us, baby. Look, look behind you. They're everywhere. This is, this is heaven. Oh, there's geese everywhere. Absolutely everywhere. Holy smokes. Well, they're doing it, boys and gals. My bolt, my bolt caught on the blind when I came up. Well, they all got up. <laughs> well, there we go. Look at old coot dog. There we go. Yep. <laughs> nice Susie. <laughs> Lots of ducks up. Get in, get in. Lots of ducks. There right, we go. Smash the thumbs up button. Come on now. It's underway. Oh my God. Nice shot. That was down on the left side. You did. <laughs> nice shot. There we go. There we go. Some honk daddies on the right. Oh, 
One got away. Now, and I only had two shells in too. What is going on? <laughs> oh, hey. one down, Big Daddy. One down. Honker, honker on the deck. Yeah, baby. Just for the honker. Hiding in the snow in these uh, white layouts, man. It's a game over type of deal. A lot of birds on the right. Ooh, right over the top. How many we dropped? Definitely overdressed. I'm a, I'm a little little warm here. Are you? Oh god. So uh, these ducks are doing it really really close. They're actually probably a lot closer than what the GoPro's giving it justice. So I switched up ammo and I moved to the tungsten. And the only reason is is because it's seven shot and BB. Uh, what I was shooting was Black Cloud number one shot, which I love. Uh, but I'm gonna. Put some more pellets out there at a closer range, that's my goal. Got a widgeon down. Got yeah, buddy. Probably been laying down shooting hunting mm, I'd say an hour right at an hour and we're five away from a one two three four five man limit that went quick midday what time is it honey do you know 237 <laughs> that's awesome that don't happen in Kansas you don't hunt midday
Unreal. Unreal. I'm limited out. I've just been filming with the phone. Absolutely gorgeous. Um, not an, an, a four man limit, not a five man limit. Two coming over top. Oh yeah. Hi, hi birds. Oh that look at that green loving it mama. Nice. Nice. Nice shot. Nice shot. Pretty, pretty terrible shooting. We tagged up on the Drake, smoked it, and then can't hit the other one to save our lives. <laughs> I didn't think that's, it was very funny. That's real. <laughs> that's real. <laughs> that's real. <laughs> that was good. <laughs> Drake is bad. Yeah. Oh well. He got smashed. He did. Thanks, guys, very much. I appreciate oh, that. No, oh, get down. Good. Very, yeah. very nice. It's awesome. What oh. a day. Hey, did we oh. tell you last night that that salmon? It's breathtaking, man. It's okay, beautiful. Thank you so much. So privileged to be here, that's man. Cool. Honored to be hey, a part delicious. of this little trip and be invited out here to Flatland with Federal. Big shout out to Federal for bringing me and the wife out here. Um, unreal. Unreal. If you guys ever want to experience mallard dry feed hunting, come up to Flatland in October, late October, and I promise you're going you're gonna to take home some experiences. I'm telling you. What, what happened? Oh, he's got a claw, dude. That's a T Rex claw. A little chicken scratch. <laughs> a little chicken scratch. That's nasty. Yeah, that's a claw. That's a. He's a fighter, dude. <laughs> it's a talon. <laughs> oh, pick it up. What time is it? Two something. Might be three now. Here we go. Four man limit. I don't know. Probably an hour and a half. Whew. The big honk, daddy. Some Susie's up front and a lot of green. I'm telling you what, some big green. Look at the head on that guy right there. That's a big one. Beauties. It's another big one right here. Look how big. You know where that guy's from, Manitoba. Oh, Manitoba Mallard. About to do some one arm curls with that bad boy? I mean, yeah, you could. <laughs> like, this is my weightlifting for the day. <laughs> I really didn't get to show you guys the spread. Tight, full bodies. Beauty, man. That's what you call easy work. Big shout out to Alex, Nick. That was amazing. That that was an amazing experience. I'm telling you what. <laughs> Did you know I was following you? No. You look so pretty out here throwing decoys around. Working. Earning you, my dinner. Earning your dinner? Yeah. You think you could get used to coming out in the field like this? No, I've had a lot of fun. Yeah. yeah. I think our clients would enjoy you coming out. You should. So. She's been taking good video for me and I mean you've been helping out everybody with cameras. Yeah. Pictures. I'm glad you came, honey. Yeah. Love you. well we are back we're back in the room yeah and uh you probably know what i'm doing already how beautiful how beautiful is this this is the view out of our bedroom window absolutely gorgeous got the window open it's like 45 degrees out yesterday the high was like 15 so uh today was extremely enjoyable Yesterday was extremely enjoyable. Today was better, not because we limited out, not because of anything, but the weather. It was nice. Sun, 11 mojos just flicking in the sunlight. Mm, it don't get any better than that. And as you can tell, the snow is melting away. It'll probably be all gone by tomorrow. 
and water, most water is already really slushy and opening up. So they're gonna get just absolutely flooded with birds here in the next two weeks. And um, just an epic spot. Epic place in, epic place in South Dakota. Not only the lodge and flatland flyways, but just, like I said, guys, if you guys wanna experience something like that today, you know, and, and, and not only the hunting being phenomenal, if you want the utmost best client care experience being taken care of, they cater to you. Check out Flatland Flyways. You will not regret it. I promise you. I promise you. You will take this these memories home that they provide you and you will keep them with you forever. It's an amazing place. Oh, but this is a situation. Uploading, not fun. I'd rather be out in the shop um, helping unload decoys and doing what Bobby likes to do. But I have to do this. I gotta eat. sit here eat my cookie and do my work on my vacation with my wife so please smash the thumbs up button and drop a good old comment for Beth I think she should hunt let's all let's all go down in the comments right now please all of you that actually do care and tell Beth when you get home you're gonna go hunting with your husband you're gonna get your hunting license make it short and sweet and just say Beth Get your hunting license. And I promise she's gonna do it. Are you ready? I'm so ready. Guys, if you haven't followed Sportswoman Courtney on Instagram, you gotta do so. I've been trying to talk her into really getting into YouTube. You're really inspiring me, Bobby. Like, <laughs> he's making me realize that I really do need to share more of my adventures on here with y'all. So that's my goal. We're gonna we're gonna work better at that. Well, we are. We are. But obviously, next morning, another duck hunt, field hunt. All the snow is pretty much gone. And we're in A-frames today. First A-frame hunt of the entire trip. Uh, wow, we're right on a big old piece of frozen water. I didn't even know that. But same spread pretty much. Different scenario, wow. We are on a huge piece of water. Check this out. Wow, I didn't even notice while it was dark. I guess there's a bunch of ducks. There's some honkers hitting this. Looks like a cut bean field. Gonna be a banger, let me tell you what. It's, it may not be a banger. Like I said in the last video, um, guys, it's not about what you kill, it's about the experience. Last hunt, this hunt, I mean, we limited out. That's always great and all, but it's nothing to brag about, you know? You brag about the memories you take home with you. Like Beth, she's sitting this last hunt out <laughs> due to uh, kinda, I think she slept wrong the first night and then, uh, her first experience two days straight being in lay down blinds kind of just cranked her neck pretty bad so i was like honey why don't you just stay home and, or why don't you just stay in bed and uh just recoup uh we fly out tonight so be expecting this hunt this is going to be the last hunt of the trip still trying to squeeze in a pheasant hunt don't know if it's going to happen i appreciate you guys being here sorry this video wasn't the longest because the hunting was great and it just happened 1 30 to 2 30 in the afternoon four man limit green heads one widgeon a honker and uh yeah it's awesome but thank you all for being here subscribe if you haven't hit the little notification bell down there it'll notify you when your boy uploads because we are waterfowl hunting all season uh the guided hunts start like november 10th so y'all have been asking so thank you all for being here but until next time